Ladies and gentlemen, now they said it was going to take months and months, but it looks like in just under 40 hours, we have the first legitimate player to 100% explore the Abyss of Legends, and that looks like it goes to Tiger Wolf. I saw all this stuff popping up on my timeline early this morning, and it looks like the time again was just under 40 hours to 100% it, which kind of lines up with what I believe is possible. The initial path, if you're speed running it, is probably out 4 5 Five hours and it looks like the additional paths as well uh, are between like six to eight depending on the path that you're going on so tiger wolf pretty much was non-stop for all five of the paths and unlike labyrinth man labyrinth has like i think six paths if you're trying to do it um uh, very very tight but seven uh, the abyss is only five paths uh, and every single path has a chest and 100 percent you get like the 2t5cc so you can see this man he's already got like three rank three six star champions he's got the corvus up there the omega up there the captain marvel up there and also the warlock at rank two looking very very nice so tiger wolf that name like it, it was really familiar to me when i saw this pop up and i checked uh what was it the gifting of event results as well and this man was actually the second blubberiest whale in the entire game directly under crystal opening whale he had the second highest score uh, in the solo spending and he carried his alliance uh, by the look of it to the top 10 in the gifting event back in December so this man a very committed very dedicated player to stay up for like that long non-stop and tackle the abyss it takes some real stamina some real persistence as well so fair play man a massive massive congratulations to Tiger Wolf myself I'm very excited to jump back into the abyss man that first live stream I had so much fun in it um nothing was like as challenging as I thought it would be it was just very 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 long it was just a massive endurance test but some of the slightly more difficult fights like massacre uh, and all sorts of additional encounters uh, are going to be in the 100% run so those aren't going to be for a few more days because like tomorrow I'm flying back to England and then Sunday I might be a little bit too knackered to boot up like an eight hour abyss stream for path number two uh, but starting next week man the journey to 100% begins so a massive congratulations to Tiger Wu for doing the Abyss of Legends 100% in under two days. That is just an absolutely astronomical achievement. And now, like the whales, you know, if you've got the right team for the Abyss and the right, like, five, six champions, like, the amount of resources and the advantage your account can get is just insane if you've got the time, the patience, and the units to do it. So, overall, man, I do have my problems with Abyss, but I like it. I think it's been really, really fun so far, uh, and I'm interested to 100% it myself. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for watching. Take care, and I hope that you have an absolutely fantastic day.